I think it is at the core. It is certainly the case if you go to places like Holland, a person with Parkinson's disease will see as many as 19 different people to help them with all aspects of the disease. It is a disease which affects the motor system, it affects the cognitive system. Among the bigger problems people have as the disease progresses are things like apathy and fatigue and depression. And so all of these things then make it much harder to kind of exist on a day-to-day -day basis as one as the disease progresses. One can also have mild cognitive impairment and this helps the thought process, or this hinders the thought process. And so as a consequence, it is a multifactorial problem and it needs a multifactorial solution. Uh, well, one other problem people have with Parkinson's disease is speech. And that's because speech is part of the motor system, and the motor system is impaired, and so they start to speak very quietly, they lose the uh, intonation when they speak, and so it's very important to have speech therapy along with occupational therapy and social work as well. So the complete package is very important, and there's emerging evidence that when people are treated by a group of specialists, by a team of specialists that they do better, that they have a higher quality of life than if they're just treated by one person alone.